The South African Parliament has voted in favour of new legislation that could see land from white farmers seized. Artis Paula Sleer has the details. The South African Parliament has backed a motion that calls for changing the constitution and allowing for land expropriation without compensation. Essentially, white South Africans will lose their land, they will not be compensated, this despite the fact that it flies in the face of the current constitution. It follows the inauguration of the South African President Cyril Ramaphosa two weeks ago. He has said that he wants to speed up the transfer of land from white to black South Africans. Now, despite the fact that apartheid ended two decades ago, you still have a situation in South Africa where most of the land is owned by whites. This is a hugely emotive subject for South Africans. The motion was brought in Parliament by the Economic Freedom Fighters Party. Now, it did receive the support of the ruling African National Congress that holds some two-thirds of the Parliament. The leader of the EFF had this to say. The time for reconciliation is over. Now is the time for justice. We must ensure that we restore the dignity of our people without compensating the criminals who stole our land. Malema is a controversial and somewhat radical figure in South Africa. In the past, he has said that he's not calling for the slaughter of white people, at least not yet. In recent years, there has been a spike in the killing of farmers in South Africa. Now, those who support the motion say it will go a long way to restoring justice. But those who criticize it say it will do anything but. There are those who say it will lead to unforeseen consequences and also will be a scapegoat that the ANC can use to explain away its own failures. Nonetheless, it certainly seems as if we're a far away from restoring racial tensions in a country that has so much history mired in them.